So we're in Tapas España. It's a great privilege to be with Jose Pizarro. Um, this fantastic tent set up by the Spanish tourist office. And we're here to showcase Alhambra, um, fantastic artisan beer um, from Granada in Spain. Named after the um, magnificent Alhambra Palace, um, the beers are all about quality. So it's quality ingredients, it's time and effort which goes into them to produce fantastic beers um, which are great with food. In addition to, to selling the beers, um, we're also running beer talks for the people um, where they get to try five different beers um, along with um, food matching descriptions and things like that. The beers are very different, they're not just your norm, um, so it's a great way of actually driving that trial and telling them a few interesting facts about the company. The brewery itself, it was set up in 1925. Um, in Granada and as I say this was their flagship brand the Alhambra Reserva. Fantastic beer, beautifully presented um, and absolutely brilliant with chorizo, certainly the stuff which Jose is producing today. In terms of the beer itself it's 6.4 percent in alcohol some people would probably sometimes think be a bit scared of that but it's not the case at all these beers are about quality not quantity so on the nose it's very floral um, it's almost got a caramel aroma to it but, and then when you taste it, it's got that real refreshment, but it lingers and goes back. You've got that depth of flavor and almost a little bit of sweetness to it as well. And that works so well with spicy food in general, really. So you get that nice comparison with the sweet and the spicy. And when you think of Spanish beers, often you do just think about straight lagers, um, but there is more to Spain than just that. Now this one's a great example, and this one's been seeing a lot of interest from the consumers. Um, it's a dark lager, so you often see these in the Czech Republic, in, in Germany and things like that, um, but you still get that carbonation, so you get that, that refreshing drink, but at the same time, you've got a bit more uh, depth of flavor, um, bitter notes, a bit of bitter chocolate almost in there. And again, that's a fantastic pairing with um, seared food. So if you've got uh, a nice seared bit of pork or even vegetables, the sweetness on the, the seared um, food will actually pick up really well with the sort of bitter notes which the, the Negra provides. I'm obviously biased, but it's an absolute beautiful beer. Um, as I say, these are the types of beer which you can enjoy, not just in Andalusia, but over Spain. Um, and on a beautiful day like this, why not, eh? Salud!